it's crack a people. It is 1.40 p.m. on January 11th, 2018. Just wanted to show you guys all the snow melt. This is just, look at this, this is crazy. There's just no, there's no snow on the roofs. Uh, I mean, a little bit on some of the shady parts left, but this is crazy, all the snow is fucking gone. And by the way, I'm taking a lot of your advice about just ignoring these pompous douchebags who who unfortunately have such pathetic existences that they have to spend time to actually talk shit to people they don't even know who are trying to do good things for other people. So yeah, I'm taking your guys' advice and I'm not gonna fucking feed into it anymore. Um, I'm just gonna block these dumbasses anyway. So yeah, this is what we got going. And then they said there's a walking, a new walking path back here. And I don't know, I don't know. You know, we'll walk over here so you guys can actually see this really cool creek. When we get mad amounts of snow, this creek starts to really, really fill up because uh, this, all the rapid snow melt. So yeah, so there's this, and then right over there is the trout pond right there. They fill it up apparently. I've never seen it full, but I've only been here almost three years. So I came up from Newport Beach. And uh, this is a definite eat shit spot right here. Okay, so look, that part of the Best Western clearly um, has snow right there, but that's a spot that doesn't see any sunlight really, or, or direct sunlight, I should say. Yeah, so this is pretty pathetic, guys, huh? Snow is gone in a freaking hat beat. In a hat beat. <coughs> Yeah, so, um, yeah, oops, shit, this fucking stuff, man, ah, so nasty walking through this, yeah, guys, so, let's do, what's up? It was supposed to get, we were supposed to get another chance at a snowstorm coming on the 19th. That's what it was saying for the past couple days actually. And then early, like about 2 a.m. the forecast changed. And on all of them, if you guys don't already know, the Weather Channel app, um, from what I've experienced, has been the most accurate for me up here. Um, however, um, most of these applications, actually all these applications get all their information from the same fucking places. They just try to put their own little twist into their forecasts. So, there's basically two main models that meteorologists and whatnot follow. The European model and the US standard model. And these are forecast models and a lot of times they are not in agreement with each other until maybe the last couple days before the event's supposed to happen. So if they agree well far out before the event is actually supposed to happen, then typically that means you're gonna get smashed with, with a huge storm. Uh, but yeah, so from my experience, guys, the Weather Channel app is by far the most accurate. I use them all, but um, I mean, I, I, I still double check and and verify all the other ones. The Weather Channel app was the only one that told me that we were gonna get maybe three to five inches of snow this last storm. It didn't say a foot of snow or two feet like every other weather station said. And you saw we got um, maybe four inches of snow, probably better off three. Uh, but hang on, I gotta go in here and get some change real quick, guys. So, hang on a second. Hey! How are you? Hi! Right on, right on. What do you want? Huh? What do you want? You know what? I just need some uh, change, if that's like like a $10 bill, if that's okay. <laughs> I'm a friend of Robert. One, two, three, four, five. So, how about a $20 bill and a $10 bill? 
Okay. I would really appreciate it. Five, 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 twenty. Yep. So a a twenty dollar bill, okay. and then these two for a ten dollar bill. I'd be super happy. How's your day going? It's fine. Good. Good. These are twenty dollars. Yes, sir. What do you need? Ten. Ten? Uh, uh, yeah, a ten dollar bill, please. And then I will be out of your hair, my friend. Thank you for being so nice. <laughs> you have a great day and ha yeah, happy new year, bro. Happy new year, man. Oh, that guy looks just like my brother who just walked in. That's crazy. That the brother he looks like is a fucking the worst kind of human being you can imagine. The kind that uh. You know, when you go to jail, you get freaking, like, these people want to murder you. And unfortunately, when he was in jail, that didn't happen to him. He didn't even get beat up, and the guy's, like, the worst fucking human being out there. Um, and when I try to fucking do something, um, then I get a restraining order put on me. So I can't even be anywhere near this fool. But anyway, you know what, let's go back to this part. I'm not back here just to see. You know what? I've never fucking noticed this. That fucking thing over there, man. Is that it right there? No, it can't be. It is. On fucking real, dude. All right. Anyway, that was something I needed to just check out real quick about a potential storage fucking issue. But we don't know. We don't know. We'll know. I don't know. Okay. Look at this guys, where's the snow man? This is insane. You know, we're just gonna fucking box up like this bitch right here. What's up man? Alright, so yeah this is pathetic guys. I mean it's good to know on snow here. Alright. So, you guys can see, if you go back and just look at the video 24 hours ago, pretty amazing. Pretty amazing, the difference. And I'll be getting better videos of different spots soon enough, guys. Just, uh, thanks for bearing with me. What's up, bro? How you doing? Good, man. Nice to see ya. Hey. Oh, yeah, baby. I think I'm gonna go get my motorcycle out of my friend's garage in a couple days. Um, I've been riding that thing well below freezing at night, which isn't too bright. Um, however, I've been especially doing it when our humidity is standard low as it usually is. This view, man, right down Moon Ridge, that beautiful mountain right there. I think that's Sugarloaf Mountain, but don't quote me. <coughs> My friend slash supervisor slash guy whose dog fucking mauled me, um, but the dog's cool as hell. Anyway, he was gonna take me hiking. He and his girl hiking up to a uh, top of of that that hike right there. Um, he's the, he's the, the the kind of dude that likes to do stuff like. The Pacific Trail and stuff, that one that goes from Mexico all the way to Canada, it's a hiking trail. He, he likes to do that shit, man. The guy is absolutely just, just insane. 
cool as fuck. He's fucking nuts to do all that. He is a lot younger than me though. Um, but yeah, so you can see over here that there's still snow, but this is all snow that was shoveled up by the, by the uh, fucking, you know, by the snow machines, whatever the fuck, snow plows, and just moved aside. So, um, but yeah, guys, this is it, man. This sucks. The huge 18 inches of snow we could have got, it just wasn't shit, man. As I said, I think we maybe had four inches that stuck, maybe. Maybe more like three and a half inches that stuck, but it still was nothing compared to what most of these weather people for, fucking forecasted. Yeah, guys, this is just insanity. Then last night, all night long, it was really weird. Like three different times, the fucking cops came in here. The cops fucking came in here, and they were for one of my fucking neighbors right here. But they were parking on this side last night, over here. And I don't know why, but they were a bunch of them, man. They came at like two, three in the morning. Um, then they came back again. Then they came back again. You know what, if my neighbor walks out here, I'm gonna ask her what the heck happened, is everybody okay? But she and her daughter fight often, which is kind of kind of sad, but it happens. It happens. Let me look at this. Oh, hello, it's a happy tree. All right, so. Since I ride, I try to take all these pine cones out of the street and I place them all like right here or I'll throw them all out around there yeah it's pretty badass pretty 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 badass and we have this whole property so like uh, and we're all super close here we watch each other's backs and the greatest part is that I can fucking park wherever I want and I can park way over there I can park right fucking there it just doesn't matter um, whatever, like, this is our whole, whole fucking property. It's just multiple acres. It's really, really nice. Um, and it's very, 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 very private. Um, but yeah, guys, there's just no snow left. No snow left. Not, not even on my car. I need to get this thing fixed up. Hey, do any of you know of someone who has a GM computer system? I'm not asking for this to be done for free or nothing but I, I had to buy a body control module to replace mine for this I installed it you can see the box right there I installed it myself but then what I found out later on after I paid three hundred and twenty dollars for the damn thing is that they need to be programmed specifically by a a GM system and the programming takes two fucking minutes but they uh, the minimum you can find it is for like hundred and ninety dollars dude because apparently that program costs them fuck man like thousands of dollars just to have that that program so they obviously passed those really horrible costs back down to us but yeah so um, for the last bit of our video let's just take a look at like some of that area up there that's uh, Catalina Street over there and I'm telling you guys we got some some really beautiful properties up here um, I mean absolutely fucking gorgeous Imagine, there's no way you're gonna find my place. It's like, dude, I pay $100 more than anybody in my little neighborhood here, and I pay $550 a month, dude. That includes water. Um, yeah, it's, it's absolutely amazing, and I have a two-story house. I mean, yeah, it's a small-ass place, but um, my, my options were a much bigger place or to rent a room from a lot of other houses for just about that same price, and it's, it, it, you know, it's a room, no privacy, so. But anyway. Take care, guys. I appreciate you guys. You guys are the best. I love you all. Stay up. Um, if you have any questions, please, please don't hesitate to shoot them out to me, and I will answer them as soon as I can. All right? Take care, guys.